मसल विशाल ठाकरे प्रोफेसर विशाल ठाकरे फ्रॉम एस एन डी कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग यवला सो टुडे वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द इन ऑटोमोबाइल इंजीनियरिंग पॉइंट और टॉपिक दैट इज एन वी एच इन ऑटोमोबाइल्स राइट सो सिंपली एन वी एच मीन्स नॉइज वाइब्रेशन एंड हार्शनेस इन योर ऑटोमोबाइल व्हीकल्स राइट सो वी हैव सिंपली see the different types of topics in the automobiles means noise vibrations or harshness in your vehicle means the uh, the energy will be produced in engine right that energy is uh, not fully utilized for uh, driving your vehicle right so that's uh, there are different types of points for the uh, your vehicle not 100 fully utilize the engine power so in this we have studied the uh, nvh in automobiles noise vibrations and harshness right the first point noise noise is a audible sound generated in vehicle or any other system including engine drive line tire contact patch and road surface brakes clutches गेयर बॉक्स कूलिंग फैन एक्सेट्रा इट कैन बी मेजर्ड राइट द नॉइज कैन बी मेजर्ड राइट विद द हेल्प ऑफ वाइब्रोमीटर वी हैव टू यूज डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ नॉइज अनोइंग और सेंसर्स वी हैव टू यूज फॉर द चेक द नॉइज ओके देन वाइब्रेशन दे आर वेरी लो फ्रिक्वेंसी एनर्जी प्रोपोगेशन इन टू द मीडियम or propagation through a medium they are produced in the drive line and the medium of vibration can be any part of a vehicle they can be measured and controlled okay so the vibration uh, they can be measured and also controlled with the help of different types of dampers are used in this system so harshness harshness is a combination of noise and vibration which creates an uncomfortable feeling in occupants of that vehicles right means harshness uh, simple uh, noise and vibration it is a combination of noise and vibration that creates a uncomfortable feeling for the uh, that person who sitting in the vehicle right they just can be felt and can be jury evaluated right then what is nvh nvh is noise vibration and harshness also known as noise and vibration is the study and modification of the noise and vibration characteristics of vehicles particularly cars and trucks okay so we have to simply find out the noise and vibrations in car and we have to uh, modifying that uh, or uh, we have to uh, decreases that noise and vibration in your automobile vehicles right so that simple uh, characteristics or that simple method is known as nvh to enhance to enhance vehicle parameter comfort and brand recognition we offer a wide range of flexible and flexible solution for capturing and analyzing nvh data in the field of noise vibration and harshness all compliance with international standards and supported by calibration services right we have to simple uh, for the performance of vehicle or comfortness of vehicle that we have to decreases that uh the noise vibrations right so we have to study that noise and vibration and we have to a uh, standard <coughs> criteria for that noise and vibration for uh, supported that uh, services on in view of vehicle for calibration of that noise and uh, vibration for the comfortness of your uh, comfortness of traveling or traveler okay then nvh types so there are mainly two types of nvh 
that is interior nvh and exterior nvh interior nvh deals with the noise and vibration experienced by the occupants of the cabin while exterior nvh is largely concerned with the noise radiated by the vehicle and included drive by noise testing right so there is simple two types of nvh so <clears throat> interior nvh means uh, when the noise uh, produces in the uh, inside the cabin or uh, when the occupants are sitting over there right and that vibration or noise are experienced right so that is simple nvh right and exterior nvh means the noise will be produced the outside of the cabin right then uh, nvh sources they including the engine drive line tire contact patch and road surface brake wind noise from cooling fans alternator and other engine accessories is also fairly common so these are the sources of noise and vibrations okay engine drive line uh, tire contact patches brakes winds then alternator fans then engine accessories okay why nvh is necessary because uh, when we have uh, overcome the uh, noise and vibration in your vehicle so that's uh, that the occupants will be comfortable uh, sitting in a uh, car or a vehicle right and we have to minimize the uh, f- uh, noise and vibration that's the uh, energy of uh, in the in- engine energy will be increases uh, when they are a uh, friction are producing in this right so uh, noise pollution so uh, why we have why we have necessary that there is a noise pollution so we have overcome that noise pollution Uh, so that's why nvh is necessary customer awareness of vehicle ride comfort for the comfort of customer that is the criteria right so that is a nvh is necessary uh, market marketability means we have to see uh, that in your in your uh, in your uh, simple example uh, the petrol engine or diesel engine right car right uh, compared to the electric car there is a m- minimum noise in a electrical engine right but uh, compared to the petrol or diesel engine there is a noise produces uh, uh, of engine or any other co- component parts right but electrical in a uh, electrical car there is a less or no uh, noise produces so uh, we have to in marketability right or market we have say that that electric car there is a no noise uh, uh, noise produces right so Uh, trends towards higher power and smaller size power plant right so uh, there is a simple uh, why uh, in which is necessary in this uh, sound quality means if you have need a sound quality that time uh, we have necessary that in in which right then design optimization design optimization we have to study there is a different types of designs uh, parameters right stray strain right then any other type so that's why we have necessary the nvh uh, for the uh, uh, nvh is necessary consistency in production when there is a noise and vibration are produces in your production then there is a uh, problems uh, created in your uh, machines right so when there is no consistency in your production so when the consistency of production we have to know the uh, we have to uh, find that there is a nvh is necessary okay so there is simple uh, why nvh is necessary then nvh classification so uh, noise vibration and harshness there is a classification classified into by noise type by vehicle system and vehicle component right so there is a simple classification okay so by nice type there are sub divided into four types road nvh wind noise power train or drive train nvh then squeak or rattle right so there are four sub uh, sub types of uh, by noise type then uh, by vehicle system there is a road body nvh and chassis nvh nvh right then 
बाय व्हीकल कंपोनेंट क्लाइमेट कंट्रोल सिस्टम वाइपर सीट मोटर्स एंड स्विचेस देन नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज अ सिंपल एन वी एच एनालिसिस सिंपल सो इन एन वी एच एनालिसिस वी हैव टू वी हैव टू नो दैट दैट इज डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ एनालिसिस सो नॉइज कंट्रीब्यूशन फ्रॉम वेरियस सिस्टम सो फैन एंड रेडिएटर असेंबली देर इज टेन परसेंटेजेस ऑफ एन वी एच राइट मीन्स नॉइज आर प्रोड्यूस इन द फैन एंड रेडिएटर असेंबली देन ड्राइव लाइन देर इज अ फोर्टीन परसेंटेज देन इंजिन ट्वेंटी वन परसेंटेज देन इंटेक सिस्टम देर इज अ फोर्टीन परसेंटेज देन एक्सॉस्ट सिस्टम देर इज अ थर्टी टू परसेंटेज नॉइज कंट्रीब्यूशन ओके देन स्ट्रक्चरल कंपोनेंट मीन्स दैट इज अ चेसी और फ्रेम एंड देन कंपोनेंट्स आर कनेक्टेड मीन्स अ माउंटिंग ऑफ इंजिन माउंटिंग ऑफ क्लच गियर बॉक्स डिफरेंशियल राइट देन मिसलेनियस आर थ्री परसेंटेज सो देर इज अ नॉइज कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ डिफरेंट कंपोनेंट राइट ऑफ यूर वेहीकल ओके देन सोल्यूशन फॉर इम्प्रूविंग नॉइज ओके रिड्यूसिंग द सोर्स स्ट्रेंथ रिड्यूसिंग द सोर्स स्ट्रेंथ एज इन मेकिंग अ नॉइज सोर्स क्विटर विथ अ मफलर और इम्प्रूविंग द बैलेंस ऑफ ए रोटेटिंग मैकेनिज्म राइट सिंपल वेन वी हैव रिड्यूसिंग द सोर्सेस वेन द नॉइज आर प्रोड्यूसेस राइट वेन देर इज अ नॉइज प्रोड्यूसेस इन दैट सोर्सेस देन वी हैव रिड्यूस दैट नॉइज राइट सो देर आर ओवरकम ऑब्वियसली राइट सो इंटरप्टिंग द नॉइज एंड वाइब्रेशन पाथ विथ बैरियर राइट वी हैव टू ब्रेक दैट नॉइज और वाइब्रेशन पाथ राइट विद द बैरियर दैट टाइम the noise or vibration will be reduces then absorption of the noise and vibration energy as for example with foam noise absorber right so these are the simple solution for improving the noise then noise vibration and harshness testing involves subjecting a full vehicle components or sub assembly or vibration at different frequencies as a means of determining mode shapes and isolating buzz squeaks and rattles right we have to study this in this huh? then uh, typical instrument instrumentation used to measure nvh includes microphone accelerometer and force gauges or load cells right when we have studied the nvh that time we have to need a uh, some instrument for Uh, counting the noise or vibrations right or calculating the noise and vibration so there is a microphone ac- uh, accelerometer force gauges and load cells are using for the uh, measuring the noise and vibration and uh, harshness of the vehicle so component and sub assembly nvh tests are most commonly performed using a vibration shaker while entire vehicle usually on the test track on or road s- simulator test bed so there is uh, the next point is nvh testing nvh testing is wise, widely used in automotive industry for the reduction design and quality assurance of interior and exterior vehicle noise and vibration right the process usually takes place during the vehicle development of the passenger cars men uh, simply uh, in this uh, nvs testing right so uh, in the production of vehicle that we have to studied uh, there are reduction design and quality assurance of interior and exterior vehicle noise of noise or vibrations in a vehicle right so that time we have to uh, see that nvs testing or we have take a testing of this right so nvh can be tonal such as engine noise or broadband such as road noise or wind noise basically it is everything that drives or passengers can either hear and feel from car while driving such as wind noise road noise bumps from the suspension or vibration from the 
NG. So when we have studied the NVH testing, that time we have to know that that these things, right? Means uh, the wind noise, wind noise, road noise, bumps, suspensions, vibrations, right? Uh, from the engine, right? So NVH application, our one-stop acoustic test solution or vibration test solution covers all essential sound and vibration right so in this test we have there is a uh, acoustic test solution and vibration test solution are very essential for when we have uh, production of any type of vehicle right so there is a essential uh, testings so applications nvh test equipments are used for various applications such as engine noise vibration testing acoustic performance testing sound power testing pass by noise testing telephone testing then environmental noise measurement and no noise field mapping then structural dynamics and vibration testing then occupational health and safety so these are the simple uh, applications right of the nvh testing then advantages of nvh testing most comfortable right right when we have reduces the noise vibration that time we have a simple um, comfortable ride okay least fatigue right when there is a no noise and vibration in this so uh, there is a least fatigue okay in this uh, on the vehicle more work ability sorry more work ab work ability of the occupant right when there is a noise or vibration or less then the more work or more driving of that vehicle or driver okay so there is a simple advantages of nvh then measurement applications such as sound level meter sound power sound quality sound intensity octave band analysis then reverberation time then pass by noise brake noise and sequel squeal then fft analysis then order tracking rational and torsional vibration and whole human body vibration analysis so when we have studied the nvh the measurement application such as all this okay so so uh, the example of the nvh uh, nvh testings or nvh we have to use so some common example where nvh analysis is applied volvo buses and trucks right so in this nvh uh, testing or analysis we have completed that time the simple the comfort ride and uh, simple uh, flexible driving we have to accomplish right so in this volvo buses and trucks are simple example so thank you uh, this topic is very important for the vehicle uh, vehicle performance right so uh, that's a simple topic in your vehicle performance okay so next lecture we have uh, studied other topic okay